Okay guys, so we're in a dozen a day, book one. Still in group one, number seven, stretching the right leg up. Now, unfortunately, we don't get to use our right leg for this one, just our right hand. Um, but that being said, we don't have to use our left hand. So we can just keep our left hand in our lap. Um, this one is super fun and super easy. Um, it may be a little tricky for some people, but there is a different exercise that might be able to help with this one if you're feeling stuck with this one. And I'll upload that one later. Uh, if you made it past six and number five, especially number five, then seven and eight are going to be a walk in the park for you. Um, so for number seven, we're holding down C through all of these as a whole note. So we cannot lift up our thumb at all. And we're playing finger number five on the letters G, A, B, and C as staccato. So our pinky needs to be raised through all of these while our thumb is being held down. And that's stretching our pinky up to an octave. Now, some of you may not be able to, you hear my dog bark, barking in the background because the UPS man is here. She's just so excited to get her package. Um, some of you guys may not be able to stretch all the way up to an octave and that is totally fine. Don't try and push your hands to the limits and your fingers to the limits. Stop wherever you feel comfortable. Maybe that means starting at F with your pinky and then going up and stopping maybe at A or at B. If you cannot make it to C, that's fine. But I don't foresee any of us going past C and going to D. So I'm going to play number seven as is, but if you cannot make it to C, and you feel uncomfortable, or if you're stretching your hands and you're dipping down below the piano or your hands all the way up here, do not go any farther than where you feel comfortable going, which will probably be B. And that will be the same for number eight as well. So you know what? I think I'll just make this one number seven and number eight because it's the same concept. Two videos, two exercises in one video. Okay, so I'm going to set the metronome to 60 BPM. And let's rock and roll. I'm starting in C position. Two, ready, play. G. A. B. C. Hold. Two, three, four, fermata. So when it has a fermata, you have to hold it longer than the four beats. Okay, let's try that one one more time. One, two, ready, play. Okay, so for the left hand, we're starting with a thumb on middle C, and then we're starting F, E, D, C, stretching down to the octave. Same concept, it may be a little bit more difficult for you in your left hand if you're right hand dominant. Okay, five, six, ready, and F, 